Okay, so with the bar I can get better range of motion it feels like um, than with the knees, but you're getting pretty advanced by the time you start using the bar. So for general rehab I'll often just use the dumbbells to do a comfortable range of motion, but when I'm getting more performance based, um, I'll use the bar. So back squat, there are several different kinds of back squats. There's power lifters will do a low bar position back squat with the bar really low, feet really wide, and they really keep the weight on their heels and squat down to roughly parallel and come back up. Olympic lifters and bodybuilders, um, and probably more, more just athletes in general, keep the bar higher and they can squat down usually a little deeper. You get more range of motion about your knees. Doesn't work the hips and the low back quite as much. But I can get down to where I'm breaking parallel pretty good and I'm keeping my chest out and my back in a neutral position or slightly arched backwards. Um, for me, some people can squat very deep with a back squat and keep, keep their spine in a good position. Um, some people, taller people especially, can't. I can go pretty far, but not the best. Now if I do a front squat, we'll have the weight up on the front of my shoulders. Now it's easy for me to drop down into a full squat position, like when I was doing my Olympic weightlifting, keeping my elbows high, and then come back up. And this is going to, by doing the front squat, I'm stressing my back less, but also strengthening my back less, but I'm getting more quadricep. So it's, it's a trade-off between the different versions of squats, what's your, your goal, what you're trying to do, and what kind of injuries you have to work with. Um, and I could say a lot more, but that's it for 